Hey there YouTube, it's Math Bowler. Welcome to my TTM Monday autograph recap video. Last week, the week of September 29th, 2024, I received 43 autographs from 13 people. I finished off four player runs. Great week. Bit of an expensive week as well as you'll see, but I'm going to show you all 13 returns in the order with which I received them. I'll let you know how many items I sent, how long it took, if I sent a, a donation, but I will not send out addresses. Those can easily be found on SCN or SCF. First up is a first-timer, Tom Timmerman, who looks like... Um, Love this facsimile right above it there on the 71. He signed three of three in 21 days. Also sent out his 71 team card because why not? And there he is on the 72. Next up, let's go to football. We did three of three in 14 days from D.D. Lewis, who included the years that he played, 68 to 81. He signed the uh, 74 team checklist and the 1980. Next up is a favorite. Send him multiple times a year. I always send him a donation. Um, he's my fave, no doubt. So we have six, uh, four of four in six days. He in I include a $10 donation we sent to Steve Blass. How can I not send to Steve Blass? Uh, guys, rookie card sign. Signed in blue Sharpie. It's his full signature. Sometimes when he's in a hurry, he does the STBL. He rarely, if ever, does that when he's signing through the mail. I have no idea what this is from. It was cut out and po put on the back of something, but it looks so great with ink on it. Oh, the test stickers. These test stickers. This was peeled off and put onto the back of something probably by a kid back in the day. Yes. Ooh, look at that one. <sighs> he wrote thanks on my note. We'll just leave it at that. <laughs> P.S. I include a, donation, a modest donation for your time. He said thank you. <laughs> All right. Next up's a first timer. Three of three, 43 days. Never sent to Bill Stoneman before. Here we go on this 68. 69. I know uh, someone who will appreciate me putting that one in here. And on the 72. Got Fergie and Tom Seaver on there as well. I think this will just stay the way it is. Next up, I completed a player run. There's a couple of the Fleer team action cards, but I'm not worried about those that much. So this was 4 of 4 in 15 days. He's $5 per. We got Larry Little. I finished off this 74 AFC semifinal card. And the other three cards I need from him, 75, 76, and 77. So I finished off the Larry Little run over the years. Wonderful. And the next person I received back, I finished his run. He's $5 per. He also signed my protective index card and the back of my note. So this is a five of three. In 22 days, we got Jose Tartable, Danny Tartable's father, on the 67, 68, which was a high number, and on the 70. He signed my protective index card. What a great signature. And he signed my note. Next up, I, will, I wasn't trying to complete his run, but he only has two cards. He signed them both in eight days. Frank Bork on the 65. Looks like he signed it in black ballpoint pen. And on the 66, uh, Jerry May is no longer with us. He had a bit of a tragic accident. Um, so, yeah, I got Frank Bork. Thank you. Next up's always cool. You'll see because of the one card. We got Paul Russell signed three of three, 56 days. This card's so cool. They have the names switched. Now I've got this signed by both of them, so I just want to get one signed by each of them individually. So check Paul off the list. Rick Russell has been a great signer. He took a break for a little while, though. People may have been inundating him with requests. And there we go on the 79. This next one's a TTM legend. He's $10 per, but his inscriptions are amazing. Three of three, 10 days, $30. We've got Vern Law, who just spanked this 1960 World, or Tops card, which was their World Series year. Two-time All-Star. He wrote the years he played for the Pirates. A Cy Young World Series champ, 1960. Beautiful. Got the action-packed card. Dang. I mean, he takes his time. 
He had Comeback Player of the Year and Lou Gehrig Award. 1965 to that one. And we completed another one of the 1961 Buck Hill Aces with him and Elroy Face on it. Dang, that looks so good. Ah, thank you, Mr. Law. Next up is a two of two in 124 days, and subsequently I finished off his run because he only had two cards. Randy Crowder. I'm sorry, he only had one card. Randy Crowder on the 77 and on the 77 team set. Why the heck not? I got three more to go. Former Pirate coming up next, four of three, as he signed the next card in only 11 days. We got Ron Brand. Now I've sent to Ron Brand before, and to the best of my knowledge, and that's a high number right there, best of my knowledge, he had never signed the index card before, so there we go. All right, next up is football, three of three, 20 days. Get Jerry Levias, who signed this 1971. Some type of team game insert or whatever you want to call these cards. Sign these in like a black ballpoint pen that was skipping quite a bit. But that's okay. That's okay. We got them on the 73 and the 75. And my last return of the week is hockey. 4 of 4, 31 days. We got Randy Moeller. Nice first timer here with some really nice blue ink on these cards. Always like that pinnacle set. And I did send a couple of Opeaches, because why not? So there you go. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite. I upload three videos a week, a TTM video on Monday, and an autograph and or trading card video on Wednesdays and Saturdays. I think my favorite is going to be the Steve Blast rookie. But, um, but yeah, I really would appreciate it if you would like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Take care, everybody.